All right, so first we'll start with you, Will Vaughn. Seems like you really sort of set the tone. Um, you're a big boy, but you move. You got some speed to you. So what what about that do you think other teams sort of don't take account for, or is it just pure you getting through the hole? I'm just getting through the hole. Whatever my linemen open up, I'm just reading and going in the hole hard and fast. Gotcha. Nick, you had a lot, a lot of runs that were more um, sort of plugging away. Both of you did. But Nick especially, it seemed like you had trouble getting, breaking off a big one, but you were still ripping, you know, four to eight yards of carry, something like that. So what's it, is it frustrating at all to not be able to rip off the big ones, or are you just happy busting out small, productive ones? It definitely is difficult, but, you know, you just got to wait till the right one hits and then just get lucky. Got gotcha. you. And one thing, one that did break the bubble screen down here, just tell me a little bit about what you saw, um, and especially right when you caught the ball. Right when I caught it, I just instantly looked at my receivers and see where they're blocking, and I just read off that. Well, Vaughn, it looked like you almost even had an interception earlier in the game, made a nice pass breakup. Is catching the ball something you work on that much, or is that something that uh, just sort of, if you can get it done, you can get it done? If you can get it, I can get it. But I'm rushing down on the quarterback, so I'm going to try to either deflect it or pick it. Gotcha. Either way. So I, this is for either of you. Um, obviously, you guys spent most of the game on the ground, especially after uh, Sam and had to leave the game. Can you guys tell me a little bit about what it uh, means for either or both of you realizing the game sort of uh, literally in your hands? It's definitely a lot of pressure, but you know, you just got to turn on the crowd, all the other outside pressure, and just focus on the game. The pressure is You got anything? Got you. All right, so um, guys, uh, looks like you're going to be playing Oneida next. I think they beat Homer tonight. Um, anything either of you guys know about them? We just know that they're a hard team. I didn't play last year in the playoffs. I was out last week, last year with a knee injury, but I'm back and we're coming for you tonight. And Nick, you were on the team last year, lost at home in the playoffs in the first round. What's it mean to be able to get it done this week, this year? It's got to, you know, very kind of stuff. You know, just got to come ready to play. It's all these things from last year. And again, this one, this will be the last one for either of you, and I'll let you guys get it, uh, get warmed up. But um, CBA, you guys didn't have any common opponents, um, but very similar records. Um, what did you guys know coming in, and what do you guys think that they did particularly well that made it such a tough game for you guys? We just knew that we couldn't take anybody lightly. Playoffs, if you get into playoffs, uh, it's basically zero and zero. It's a new season, so we can't take no opponent lightly. We just gotta go one game at a time and continue our road to the dome. Every game like a playoff game, not a championship game.